what's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of crashing freezing or lagging issue in phasmophobia so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll probably know what to do in order to fix these issues before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know let you guys know that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right onto my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So as the first step I would recommend doing for everybody, uh, I would say that you need to start your task manager by using the shortcut or right clicking your taskbar and opening up your task manager. What I want you to do next is uh, gonna be to uh, navigate to the top left corner of your screen and clicking onto processes just to ensure that you're sticking around it. And I know guys, the next step is gonna sound a little bit weird, but trust me, uh, it will help you a lot. So I want you to basically end every single task by right clicking and clicking onto end task, which has nothing to do with Windows. So two reasons for that. So the first reason is that too many processes, tasks, apps, whatever, running at the same time uh, could cause crashes, freezes, whatever especially on low-end PCs your PC can't handle that anymore and that just causes crashes or freezes. And the second thing, like it was for me, it is like uh, some applications, some processes, don't ask me why, are third parting your main game causing to crash or to freeze or to lag. Don't ask me why, just it happens. And uh, by just ending every single task, you're avoiding this issue. So guys, once you're finished here, I want you to right click and end the task. As the next step, I want you to search an empty spot on your desktop. Once you find it, right click, display settings, stick around display and as the first step, identify which your main monitor is. Obviously this just applies if you have more than one monitor. Once you identified it, I want you to scroll down and just stick around scale and layout where I want you to change the size of text apps and other items to 100% as recommended. And the display resolution should be, should be the same as in games. So for example, if you're running in game 1720 by 1070, I want you also to, uh, to put your display resolution on that. Once you've finished here, I want you to end this task and navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, opening up your settings. What I want you to do next is gonna be to navigate right into update and security. I want you to stick around Windows Update. And I know guys, it's gonna sound a little bit basic, but trust me, updating every single driver you could possibly update on your PC will help you a lot with every kind of technical issue you're currently having on your PC and also with crashing or freezing. So trust me guys, and update your Windows. You're pro providing the best possible performance for your PC doing like that. And once you're finished here, I want you to close this one down and do the same thing for your graphics card. So if you have AMD or Nvidia, doesn't really matter. Just go to the application or the browser and download the latest version of your driver. This will just provide the best possible performance in general for your PC and help you out a lot. Yeah guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. And I'm really sorry guys if I couldn't help you, but I'm just here to try my, trying to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.